A message from teachers to the state house. We must fund education. Step one, and state rep Ryan Hatfield believes, is giving Hoosier teachers a raise. It's a long time overdue. According to the National Education Association, the average starting salary in Indiana last year was $35,000. That's below Illinois' 39000 and Kentucky's 36 and a half. In Indiana, we lag behind most of the country in what we pay our teachers. We need to do a better job. EVSC teachers are among the most well paid in the state, but start at $38,000 per year. If we're not paying our teachers, nothing else we're doing is matters. They're on the front lines from age 5 to age 18. Evansville Teachers Association President Michael Rust says the state has a teacher shortage and it's hurting students. We're talking about teachers that are retiring. Uh, five to ten years before they would have retired, teachers in midstream that, you know, they give up their five years from full retirement and they're like, I, I, I can't handle the stress anymore. And Rust move says on. teachers aren't looking to Indiana for jobs and university education programs are suffering. We don't have teachers coming in to replace those teachers. Teachers are leaving the education field because they can make more money elsewhere with a lot less stress. The bill does not have funding included, and Rust believes that'll make it tough for lawmakers to pass. We need to do a better job at making sure that the teachers are able to concentrate on what's going on in the classroom and not worrying about paying their bills. Hatfield challenges budget writers to reorganize the general fund to make it happen. One thing it does, it gets the conversation started.